Hi everyone. So I got my tea right here. We all good to go. Let's get into the video, which is why we are here in the first place to talk about why I moved back to India. A lot of friends of mine asking me a big question: Why I moved back to India after living such a good life in US for so many years? So I figured. Why not make a video and share it here? A decade ago, I went to US for a postgrad degree. <laughs> I will not lie, I just loved it. What is not there to love? No pollution, clean surroundings, big houses, big backyards, and last not the least, general process of doing things. I met my wife in a university. We fall in love, got married, and were basically living a happy American dream. After moving back from America, there's only one thing I miss about America: buying things or sign up for something without harassing by OTPs. The customer care actually discreet the situation instead of increasing my BP higher every time. You know what I am saying. <laughs> so, everything was good, good food, good life, good people, all good, but never felt at home. After two years of initial excitement died down, the reality set in. I felt I was homesick, but that feeling never went away. To top it off. My parents were not getting any more younger. We have relatives, but they are just like relatives who are just there for festivals and occasions. About an year ago, we didn't want to deal with going back and forth anymore. With this pandemic and everything, we didn't know when it's going to be normal and if we could see our parents again. This whole feeling. Scared me a lot. Huh? Then we took a decision and plunged it and moved back. Honestly, when I wake up in the morning and see my parents having me around, this is the best decision I have taken in my life. So here, what we did, as soon as they announced lockdown in early stages of 2020. We decided a rushed move. At that point of time, we didn't know when it's going to be open. Airports were shutting down. Grocery shops were not operating normally. Everything was in mess. So we decided to move back immediately. The first thing I did to search for a job to make sure we started off right. I was lucky enough. My wife called up her old employer back in India before coming to US for her post graduation. He offered her a job when we moved back. So everything was sorted. My office offered me an equivalent role in India. Everything was falling in place as if universe is aligned with our decision. Luckily, my friend who just moved back to India before us, he had a complete checklist of what to wind up. Stuff like utility, gas, etc. So we called up gas, water, every possible utility company. to tell them we are closing down the account we checked with apartment management also they were ready to help in winding up the things of the apartment so as for the move my friend suggested me sfl thank god for the company it's a indian owned family company which has branches in india and understand india like you and me so they guided us on a last minute considering we have to leave asap basically they offered two types of shipping one is air one is ocean air one was little expensive than ocean obviously so for our situation we felt that air is a better option for immediate things like clothes documents etc for larger things like tv furniture which we didn't want immediately we opted for a ocean route ocean route was super cheap the only downside was Ocean shipping was little slow. It takes two to four months to arrive. 
The other thing we didn't want to pay the fees of commercial airlines extra baggage charges, which is through the roof. So this was the better plan. SFL was so professional. They set up an appointment. Even they packed our things and shipped directly to our Indian address. My wife wanted some stuff from US because we left it in a hurry. We didn't have time to shop. SFL provided us a free US address. So we ordered and shipped directly to their address. SFL took care of everything and they shipped everything to our Indian address. So simple. So if you want to move back to India or any other country in the world, I highly recommend them, especially to India, because they know the condition and they handle custom easily. I'm going to put the details in the description. So if you want a shipping company, you know where to click. Thank you for sitting patiently with me through this video. If you have any questions or need any help planning your move, I'll be happy to help. I'll also be sharing this video on the SFL channel. So if you are watching this on this channel, I hope this will help you with your move. By the way, SFL is also good with if you need help with stuff like finding accommodation or any other things like finding a handyman shipping from a US store and all. So yeah, there you go. Okay. All right, bye.